Cole on Wheels, and you're watching Roller Skate Stories. Hey, guess what? It's time for another Roller Skate Short Story. All right, I'm here with Vmore, and uh, you are a, a slider. Yeah. Now, those seem so difficult to me. Is it difficult for you? Um, at first, when I first started skating, um, I was on a, I was on the vanilla also, and then I seen sliders and I switched over. It was a little complicated at first, but once you get used to it, it's a, it's a different type of skating. Yeah, I would say it's a way different type of skating. You don't have as much grip as you do on the. Uh, uh, on the quads, on the, the regular quads? quads? On the regular quads, yeah. yeah. That's about it. It's just, that's about it for me. But you can probably do more, right? More tricks? Um, I feel like, as, if you use a good boot, if you're a good boot, as a good, a good boot, like a good boot skater, I feel like you can do the same on the slider. I don't, I don't see it as much different, but I just see that we just have a little bit of dis a disadvantage because of less grip. But it looks looks really cool as you're sliding across the floor. Yeah, it's cool. It's, it's I, I'm trying to get better. I ain't gonna lie. I've only been doing it for like a, a good year, probably now. Really? Yeah, about like a year. When did you start roller skating? Uh, I'm not gonna lie. I moved out of I moved out here about three years ago. From uh, I'm not I'm from Maryland. I'm from East Coast. Um, from Baltimore. But I moved out here. I came I came up here. I didn't I didn't know anything for real. But I was like, let me try something new and went skating and I've seen this. So you didn't skate in Baltimore at all? Never. Wow. So you're really progressing fast. Yeah, I'm trying to get better, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I'm trying to. Yeah, you do great. I've been watching a lot of people trying to get my uh, bouncing and that's about it. To my, uh, Who, who's your inspiration? Uh, I don't know. I really don't know if I have an inspiration. I feel like my inspiration is myself and I feel like as, if I can progress, if I can progress as I want to progress, I'll be one of the best, so I don't know. Yeah. So you seem like you're really passionate about skating. Yeah, I just started it, but I just started to really take it uh, seriously about like a year ago, really. I just got into it. I, it was like I had to get off the streets because I was in a lot of weird situations and I didn't want to be in no more, so it was like better myself. So skating is just to take my stuff off of stuff. That's awesome. Yeah, that's great. Now, this is one of my main priorities now. Like I got to skate at least once a week. Yeah, and I, I see you here all the time, so that's good. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you. We appreciate you taking the time to talk to us. No problem. All thank right. you. Take care. My name is Eden, and you're watching Roller Skate Stories. Thanks for watching another great roller skate short story. He's Marcus. I'm not. And <laughs> we want to thank Larry at Skateland Chandler. Thank you, Roger. No problem. Join us for Turned Up Tuesdays every Tuesday. DJ K. Hamill. The freshest DJ in Arizona. From, from 8 to 11. <laughs> we'll see you there. Subscribe. Be sure to like and subscribe. That teleprompter just isn't moving today. Um, have, uh, contact it's moving us, really fast right contact now. Contact us at rollerskatestories at gmail.com. Check out Instagram. He's always got something really cool going on over there. And make sure you stay up to date on the stuff that he's got going on on YouTube. And we'll see you next time on Roller Skate Stories. <laughs>